Today is Monday, November 14th, 2022. I'm Ryan. And I'm Amelia. Welcome to The Cub Report, your daily source of information about what's going on here at Park. The Cub Report is our way of letting students, staff, and families know everything that is going on at Park and to create a better connection among everyone. We kick out The Cub Report by celebrating this week's birthdays. For lunch today, we will have... Today is National Pickle Day. Yes, this is a real day. According to Google, November 14th was set aside as National Pickle Day in honor of fermented foods. Thank you, Frank Perez and Izzy Bernard, for bringing this day to our attention. Students, starting today, you will no longer be able to walk across the baseball fields after school. Students must use the sidewalk on 10th or walk on the track to get to Garfield Street. There are no sporting events today. Last week, our choir students had a concert and they did an awesome job. Here are some clips for those of you who didn't get to see it in person. We are so proud of you, Cubs! Some of our web leaders have interviewed some of our staff members who are veterans. Here are those interviews. What branch of the military were you in? I was in the United States Air Force for 21 years. Why did you join? I joined the military because I used to work construction before that and that was a lot of work. So I was like, you know what, I'll go join the military. and. Then I can help, you know, serve my country and do awesome things, and I really got to do some amazing things. How many years did you serve? I served 21 years. I served 21 years and 8 months, 7 days. What was your experience like? Hmm, I had a lot of experiences after 21 years. I was been all over the world. I've been in Saudi Arabia. I used to live two hours from Paris. I lived in, uh, Oklahoma, I lived in California, I lived in Korea, I lived in Japan, where the food was beautiful, beautiful Okinawa, okay, Japan. Uh, so I just had experiences of all different cultures and got to love both all these cultures that I would have never had the opportunity to go to or see. I got the opportunity to do it and I didn't have to pay for it. What does Veterans Day mean to you? Veterans Day is such an awesome holiday because it gives the opportunity for us to remember the military people and the police and the medical people, uh, the hospitals and all, the, all of that and the firemen and gives us an opportunity to thank them for their great service that they've given to our country, to our city and to our communities. Thank you for your service. Thank you for interviewing with us. Absolutely. Thank you girls. <laughs>
What branch of the military were you in? I was in the Air Force. <laughs> Why did you join the military? Why did I join the military? Uh, I thought I wanted to fly, actually. So Air Force, you know, air, flying, that all goes together, right? But I ended up just working on airplanes instead of flying them. But that was pretty cool. I'm sorry. How many years did you serve? Just two. Just two simple years. But I did serve seven months in Afghanistan as well. What was your experience like? What was my experience like? My experience was pretty, it was pretty good. Uh, a lot of different experiences, kind of a mixture of good, bad, and something different. Uh, met a lot of interesting people, saw a few interesting places, and learned about myself. So I think that was the best part, is learning about yourself. What does Veterans Day mean to you? Veterans Day, uh, it's actually quite special to me because I appreciate the veterans, everybody who has served, currently serving in the military to protect our, our country and our freedoms. And it's important to me because I am one. So I appreciate that and know, that, know their sacrifice since I've been there. Thank you for meeting with us. You're very welcome, anytime. Thank you for your service. <laughs> it's time for Can You Guess Who? The cover report can be found by going online to www.youtube.com slash park middle school cubs. If you have any thoughts, suggestions, or shout outs for the cover report, send them to bit.ly slash park cub report submissions. That's all for today, Cubs. Have a great week and remember, all children are capable of success, no, no exceptions. exceptions.